All right, day one in the books, just kind of your assessment um, of how things went today. Um, I think I think believe things went well. Uh, we also, we had a ten day break, so I believe guys really uh, took the craft series and trained hard and came back today and just ready to focus play football. Um, at, you know, when is your first day back of fall camp and you ain't really been in the sun like that? It's gonna hit you. So I believe everybody was fighting through adversity because I'm sure everybody got a little tired out there. So um, I believe everything went well and ready to get ready get better that we did for everything that we did today and just get ready for tomorrow. Coach's poll came out, and I mean, y'all knew you had a tough schedule. That, that obviously solidified it. As you look at it, and is there any conversations afterwards about you know how difficult things going to be this year? Man, listen, we, we week by week. Um, I can't look until what's going to happen into November uh, or October. We're going to be week by week. We're going to take one game at a time, and we're going to try to we're going to win every game at a time, one game at a time, and we're just going to do what we do. And that that's going to be try to. This 2019, uh, 2019 team, we're going to win. And I believe that everybody's ready to ride for the brand. Ride for the brand. That's like the new thing. It's like this revamped Gus. We were just talking to Will about it. You know, he says he's more relatable to players, that like he kind of has more an open door policy. How have you seen your head coach change? Man, I have never seen Coach Mazon like this. I mean, he's fun to be around. Um, him just opening up to us and telling us his story and why he is like he is. I mean, you can't do nothing but respect him. Like, you can't do nothing but respect Coach, Coach Mazan. And I give him the utmost respect, and I enjoy playing for him. And, this, and f with him being so real, I mean, it makes you want to be real with everybody around you. Um, there's no holding back. There's, like, because a lot of people on the team are going through something. I mean, no matter if they look like it or not, everybody's going through something. And for him, like, to open up, I mean, it may start making us open up. So I started opening up to people, and people start opening up back up to everybody. I mean, so. I believe he's actually helping the team become closer and for, and really installing brotherhood. How much does that make you want to fight for your head coach, not only off the field, but on the field, and, and just kind of have that drive for him? It made me want to fight a lot because knowing what, how he got here and knowing like the question mark that he had when, before, when he started coaching, I mean, he said he used to drive trucks. So, like, like now, you know, that story kicked, sound like it's made up. But man, just how he got here and the perseverance that he had, and, and how people just come at him year after year, and I mean, and he's still fighting and he's still trying to show 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 us that he still coached my son. And at the end of the day, I mean, he can't be Gus my son too. We can we just be ourselves around him. I mean, and that's big, man. You really want to fight for somebody who you love, and I believe that we start like we really love coach. I mean, everybody ain't nobody saying nothing positive, like bad. We don't. We don't feed into all the stuff on the media year after year about all the bad stuff about his offense and everything. We just love who he is. He's a big guy to set goals. It's obviously the first day of camp, but what's the team goal by the end of camp and what's your personal goals too? The team goal by the end of camp is to make sure that we master our craft and everything that we can be. And our team goal is to be number one in everything across the board and win and win it all. Uh, first we're going to win the SEC, and then we're going to win it all. But we want to be the number one offense, number one defense, number one special teams in the country. And I believe we really have the tools to do it. And the goal for yourself by the end of camp, too. The well, goal by, my, by myself is just be ready to play game one and be able to be who I, who I know I can be game one. Uh, that's, that's all it is. I mean, just knowing going out there, knowing that, that everything is going to be all right. I mean, and just play. I, I just want to play free and just play like I, like I know I can. You guys obviously have one of the best D-lines in the country. What's it like playing behind those guys? It's fun, man. It's fun when you playing behind Derrick Brown, uh, Marlon Davis and Nick Cole, TD and Truesdale, uh, Connors. I mean, it's, when you playing behind guys like that, it makes, it makes your job as a linebacker a lot easier than it, would, than it would be not playing behind anybody. You don't have to worry about blockers that much. and Just being able to play fast and get to the ball. Having graduated guys, specifically Deshaun, you know, in that position, I mean, how has the leadership maybe changed in your unit? Uh, the leadership, oh, man, listen, the foundation was uh, established way before Deshaun and them. I mean, Coach T. Wood have established the linebacker foundation. Like, what we're doing with our group is trying to just keep everything going. It's, it should be like a basketball rolling down the street. Everything should just keep it rolling. Nothing should change. And, which we're really doing that. I believe we're, I believe we're, we're actually picking up the pace with everything we're doing. And we, we just know, like, right now, there's nobody talking about the Auburn linebackers, like, to be honest. Like, everybody's got a question mark about us. 
and uh, we know that and this year we gonna like show y'all like like Daryl and Deshaun and Trey and Monte did when before Coach T got the job. I mean it was a question mark then, but man, we were ready to just play.